Here's my new favorite uh, lap pull down attachment. It's a 119 centimeter long straight bar with uh, a bit of a kink in the middle. And I've been trying to find this for so long. Uh, wide lap bars uh, are, are hard to find um, that are a decent weight. Now this is only 1.85 kilos, which is what you want. A solid steel one would weigh a lot more than that. And the issue with weight with these bars is when you go to change your weight, um, depending on your weight stack, if your bar is heavier than your, your header plate, the, the uh, weight, the top plate lifts up and it makes it harder to get your, your pin in. Not a big issue if you know that it's gonna do it. I always just press down, but a lot of people don't. Also too, in a gym environment, if it's long and heavy, it's gonna swing more violently. So this is perfect. Um, it's got the aluminium centerpiece, which revolves. It's got these nice little aluminium end caps. Uh, the grip is like a tread pattern. Um, feels really good and just to, to give you a rough comparison, I'll just get through here, Dom. <coughs> so this is my old wide lap pull down bar that I'd use. So you can see it's, it's just that little bit longer and straighter. It has got a bit of a kink at the end, which is good, but on the machine, it feels great. You just roll it around. So that wide grip um, feels great. It's, as I said, it's got a slide angle, which makes it easier on the wrist. Um, another great exercise that I found with it is on the Trinity, we can we can actually grip it. And the little kink gives you a bit extra range of motion on that mid row. Um, perfect for tricep press downs. and obviously bicep curls as well. Um, at the moment, we're selling these for $80. Um, now, they're not gonna last as long as a, a solid steel lap pull-down bar. A solid steel lap pull-down bar lasts pretty much forever. Um, the grip feels really, you know, decent. Um, I mean, the only issue I've come across is it's got these little uh, rings, sort of like a, the equivalent of a knurl mark, so you know where to put your hands. Because it's um, aluminium on rubber, I don't know if it came with a little dint in it, but either it, you know, it's probably bashed up against the, the machine when I've been using it. I can't find it, so it's not too bad. But other than that, yeah, for the price, for what it does, yeah, if you're looking for that long, wide straight bar, I can definitely recommend that this is a good one. Thanks.